Just stop with all this. The Steelers are going to beat Brady and Foxborough stuff. It's not happening. They couldn't beat him there if they tried. Brady will mess with them all night. Are you kidding me? In the opening game of the NFL season when they're uh, raising their banner and celebrating their Super Bowl win, his fourth Super Bowl, he's going to go out and lose to the uh, road, just worthless Pittsburgh Steelers? Please. Did you see them play? I know it doesn't matter, but did you see how pathetic they were against the Vikings? They can't even, they can't even stop the Minnesota Vikings, for Christ's sakes. Seriously. Are you kidding me? That defense was so horrible last year, Tom Brady would slice them apart like a meat cleaver. They should be so lucky if they have to take on Garoppolo. If they face Garoppolo, they got a chance. They face Brady, they're dead. I don't even care if Roethlisberger throws four touchdowns, they'll still lose. Because Brady will throw five. If that guy gets to play in that game, you might as well not show up for the game. They have no chance. What was that number? Three and a half, now it's three? If Brady's playing in that game, they'll win that game. If Brady gets to play, forget it. I mean, please. You know, the Steelers, without Bell, and all they have is Roethlisberger and Brown, they better have a hell of a game. Because last year they couldn't stop anybody. That defense was so overrated and pathetic. And they, you know what? I've heard all this I can take about Shazier. Oh, he's so great. He's so fast. He did nothing since they drafted him. Nothing. He's done nothing. Absolutely nothing. So when you're mid, you know, 17th in the league, when you're halfway home and you're, you just don't even matter, I mean, bro, you got to be top eight in the league at least in defense to stop a guy like that on the road in the NFL, please. 17th, you can't stop anybody. <laughs> Half the league scores on you at will. They went 11-5. You know why they lost in the playoffs? Because they have no defense. There you go. No defense. That was it. Roethlisberger's great. Br Brown's great. Bell's great. But if Bell's not playing and you got an average defense, you're not beating Tom Brady. It's not happening. 